Hello my friends, in this tutorial video I'm going to show you how to create multi-step form for your WordPress website. I don't know have you ever considered building a multi-step form for your WordPress website or not, but by using Elementor Pro plugin it's easy and you can easily create a multi-step form for your WordPress for getting information of your users or for registrations and many other usages so if you have not installed this precious plugin you can watch my previous tutorials about installing elementor pro plugin on your wordpress in this tutorial video we are going to create a multi-step form together and sending its information to our specific email if you are ready let's go Okay friends, as you can see my website is a simple WordPress and for adding a multi-step form to it, first of all I should log into its backend and admin panel by typing slash slash wp dash admin. I log into my uh, admin area of my WordPress website in this first page I can see my dashboard for creating multi step form using Elementor Pro in this page on left side I go to Elementor and getting started I go to Elementor menu and select getting started for creating the first page because first of all I should create a page that this page includes multi-step form okay I press create your first page yes uh, Elementor is loaded Elementor plugin is loaded as you can see a free Elementor just has simple options like basics like uh, adding uh, heading images uh, inserting videos to your website but uh, for creating multi-step form we should use Elementor Pro Elementor Pro and you have uh, you have to install it if you have not installed this uh, precious plugin you can go to watch my previous tutorials about uh, installing Elementor Pro okay here in this section Elementor Pro I choose form widget and just drag it to this area okay here as you can see uh, by dragging this form widget I can have a simple form maybe uh, I can use it on my contact form uh, it has name email message but it's very simple for creating multi step form uh, I should edit it and adding some uh, steps by adding some questions uh, but uh, let's consider this simple form by uh, changing these values here for example for name if you go to this left side uh, you can change the label from name to for example first name okay also you can change this uh, placeholder name and from name you can change it to first name okay just we want to have a quick review okay and for email for email uh, I can change its value for label and placeholder but I don't do it also I can select it be required or not usually email is required but uh, in this tutorial I uh, press no because we are going to uh, go forward quickly okay about the message also 
we can change label and its place uh, holder name okay this is our first step but in second step we are going to ask a question about for example about the gender of our uh, user for adding a new step to my form just uh, go here and press add item and uh, select its type uh, by default it's text but for adding a step we should use this option step okay also for my step here uh, my second step I can uh, have a label and previous button next button I select the name for example here step two okay it's my step two but uh, nothing is here for uh, adding a field in step two I can use uh, again add item for example in this step I want to ask my user what is its gender okay uh, I can choose this option using select and uh, writing gender here gender male press enter female my second step has a question with two option okay and uh, it's not required okay let's fill our form by first name email for example a message next when we go to second step uh, the gender is shown female i can select male or female and also i can go to previous step but let's consider it again let's consider our form uh, again here item item one is our first step and i can change its label to step step one okay as you can see all these fields i mean first name email and message when are under step one are shown here and gender when is under step two is shown in second step also i can uh, have other step the third one and item here uh, for the third step i select this option and i can use i can use a label for it about for example i want to ask a question about uh, their uh, marriage situation okay and uh, for for this step i can also use this label i think it's better step three step three yes it's better and uh, here i want to ask a question about the marriage i can add item i can add item here item eight and changing its type for example i want to use uh, this one this checkbox label dot marriage my option will be for example single or 
single or divorced that means I use radio button because uh, each person can have only one situation not all of them uh, each person is single or divorced uh, just it's a tutorial uh, okay and let's review our forms again my first name Omid email for example message next gender mail next go to uh, third step about the marriage single divorced I should also add married too. I go to this option marriage and add married for example okay let's check it again my first name I need email British media at gmail.com message next about the uh, gender mail next step single divorced married I select this form and uh, it's ready for sending information okay our multi-step form is created but we should uh, we should uh, we should determine uh, what action after submit we want here uh, we can add action go to email email add action email and here I can uh, select I can select to which email I want to send this information okay to webishmedia gmail.com and it's uh, it's subject and the message will be all fields that uh, contains all the fields all fields okay and here I can publish this multi-step for why your post is live have a look let's have a look here yes our multi-step form is created first first name we will check it again okay email Webish media at gmail.com message it is a multi step form okay next step about the gender mail next about the marriage married and we send it okay the form was sent successfully also we can change uh, this message by changing the value of uh, our form okay uh, it's done and let's go to my gmail and check the information if I could receive it or not okay I log into my email uh, the information of multi step form hasn't come to my inbox but uh, maybe uh, it has come to spam folder I check it yes yes as you can see this information has come here and you can uh, have some chance to transfer this information 
from a spam folder to your inbox but in this uh, tutorial video i wanted to show you how to create multi-step forms on your wordpress uh, website using elementor pro plugin i hope this tutorial be useful for you just remember to subscribe my channel and uh, support my channel by your likes and comments thank you